Now the regional uh, acted in, in Camp View, uh, Jalingo Terrible State, uh, is a collaboration with the uh, Argo Rand Foundation uh, to promote innovation uh, and digital skills. The event aims to nurture local talent in line with the state government digital growth vision. The Commission of Science and Technology plans to establish a technology hub for tech-driven activities, promoting community development and international standards. And as the government, the government of the excellencies of our good campus, we are committed to providing you with the platform. The knowledge and skill is with you, but all that you can do as government under the leadership of his excellency is to provide you with the platform, provide you with the connectivity, provide you with partners as Angora have done to us today. You all know the prices that are at stake in hard currencies. Thousands of dollars are involved. I encourage you yesterday to be serious that this award shouldn't be won by those online, but that all of it should be won by you that are seated here so that we celebrate you more. Itaraba State uh, uh, has a lot of potentials, and then how to harness it is another problem. But the executive government of Taraba State has already uh, made a proper plan uh, to come up with an atmosphere, a conducive one, that can be able to accommodate this uh, young talent that we have. That was why uh, we have arrangement to come up uh, with the establishment of technology village. And then this tech village that we're talking about, you know, is an entity uh, that, you know, uh, 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 can accommodate different skills there. Uh, what I mean by this, in, 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 in technology village, we have a provision of ICT hall. We have data center, raw materials, uh, you know, uh, you know R&D center, and so many uh, technological activities will be taking place there. So by the time that, that we have this uh, project on ground, so all our young talent, both in basics, and tertiary institution will come up with uh, all their all research there and then they can be able to showcase to the world. We've done this a little differently. Well, we have this hackathon running for almost the whole month and in between, the, uh, in the middle of it, we are having workshops and then today on Friday. So this will help them to understand how the technology works and empower them to actually then participate in the hackathon. So after those workshops, we mm -hmm. then go into the world. Now, this uh, program is not just for software developers, but it's also for entrepreneurs. So we are bringing entrepreneurs, software developers together. We train the software developers. We pair them with the entrepreneurs or we pair themselves. They will form teams of five each, and those teams will come uh, for the prizes. The prizes we have are up to $20,000 plus, is more than that. So different teams are competing across different tracks. We're looking at decentralized identity, we're looking at supply chain management, we're looking at financial inclusion, and we also have technical challenges. So it's both an educational experience, but at the same time, it's an opportunity to build solutions that can be used in Taraba, in Nigeria, and they can also be used globally. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.